hour ago, the jury finds a father guilty of killing his own daughter. Thanks for choosing us tonight. I'm Katie Rammel. ABC 15's Ruta Bay Shabazi was in the courtroom and joins us live. And Ruta Bay, I understand uh, prosecutors might have been hoping for more. Yeah, Katie, prosecutors were hoping for a life sentence, but the jury found Falah al-Maliki not guilty of first-degree murder for hitting and killing his daughter, nor with his Jeep. He was also found not guilty of attempted first-degree murder for hitting his daughter's friend, Amal Khalef, in that same collision. We, the jury, duly impaneled and sworn in the above entitled action upon our oaths do find the defendant, Falah Hassan al-Maliki, as to count one, second-degree murder, a defendant a domestic violence offense as to victim Noor Falah Amaleki guilty. He was found guilty of second degree murder, aggravated assault and two counts of leaving the scene of an accident. Amaleki didn't express any emotion during the verdict. Prosecutors say he planned to kill his daughter because she was becoming too westernized and she thought he was, she was bringing disgrace on the family. But the jury wasn't convinced that he planned the crime. The surviving victim will testify tomorrow for the aggravation portion of the charges. So again, a life sentence off the table and said Al-Maliki faces 10 to 22 years in prison. Reporting live at the courthouse, Rudabe Shabazi, ABC 15 News. Thanks.